Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. HTT-40 is a basic trainer aircraft currently being indigenously designed and developed by HL. It would be used for basic flight training, aerobatics, instrument flying and close formation flights whereas its secondary role would include navigation and night flying. It is an all-metal tandem seat aircraft with a bubble canopy and a T-tail configuration. It also includes air-conditioned cockpit, zero-zero ejection seats and multi-functional displays. It features a retractable tricycle landing gear system with a steerable nose wheel. The aircraft is powered by TPE 3312B Honeywell engines which can deliver 40 hours of flying for the same cost as an F-16 or MiG-29 will deliver in just one hour. Which kind of explains why the plane gets the number 40 in its name. On July 27, 2022, HAL signed a contract worth 100 million US dollars for supply and manufacture of 88 of these engines and kits along with maintenance and support services to power the SCT-40. The aircraft can fly up to 600 km per hour and reach an altitude of 6 km. The aircraft has capability to be converted to armed or weaponized version at a later stage. With a maximum takeoff weight of 2800 kg, the trainer can be configured to carry a gun, rockets and bombs to perform light combat and counter-insurgency missions. In August 2021, the aircraft has successfully completed 8-turn spin capability on both right-hand and left-hand side with gantry. It has also successfully completed 6-turn spin without anti-spin parachute system. It has already demonstrated 10-turn spins and ready for operational clearance. STT-40 also participated in flying display during Aero India 2021. A total of three prototypes have been built, which includes two flying prototypes and one structural test specimen. On 6 June 2022, STT-40 received its airworthiness clearance certificate from CEMILSE. The project set a record as the fastest to reach certification from the first flight. STT-40 is designed to the PSQR issued by Indian Air Force and FR-23 standards. All PSQR performance have been met with a gross weight of 3050 kg. HL has also successfully integrated and flown lithium main battery on STT-40 and making it first in the continent using lithium battery for military aviation. In 4th February 2021, an RFP for 70 STT-40 aircraft was received from Indian Air Force with additional clause of 38 more. The response to the RFP have been submitted by HL in April 2021 which is at present under evaluation. Taking into the capability of the proposed turboprop aircraft, market studies, upgrade functionality etc. The requirement of 290 aircraft which includes 70 aircraft for Indian Air Force and 220 aircraft for other customers has been projected by HL. S-2040 will boost the Indian Air Force capability and requirement of a Stage 1 trainer aircraft. Indian Air Force currently relies on its fleet of Pilatus PC-7 aircraft from Switzerland. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.